What we're going to be tying here is a coronamid. We're going to start off with some red thread near the eye of the hook. Next we're going to take some Antron We're going to tie this in all the way down to the length of the hook. Like so. And this will be our tail. And I usually clip it short, just like so. Next, we're going to take some D rib, red D rib. We're going to tie that in. And we're going to wrap that around the hook. And as I wrap this, I pull it tight and stretch it nice and thin. And I'm going to leave a little bit of room up there by the head. Next thing we're going to do is we're going to tie in some pheasant tail for the casing. Just like that. Next thing I'm going to do so I'm going to tie in some more Antron for the gills. I'm actually going to figure eight this in on the head. Right up near the front. I'm going to leave it long. That way when I tie my next material in I can wrap around it easily. Just tie it in just like that. Next, I'm going to take a couple strands of peacock. I'm going to tie those in right back by that casing we tied in. I'm going to take my thread to the eye of the hook. Now, I'm going to wrap this peacock around the head. Got a piece of Antron fighting me there. I'll kind of go around that figure eight there. Then I capture those pieces of peacock. Take my pheasant tail and pull it over the top. Capture it. I can trim it all out of there. Then you can whip finish. like that. And then I'm going to trim these pieces of Antron for the gills. Equal length on each side. Fluff them out a little. And that is a coronamid.